plants don't move, they don't hunt, they don't kill. But one plant breaks the rules. Meet the Venus flytrap, Earth's most deceptive predator. It doesn't chase, it waits, it lures, and then, it snaps. The Venus flytrap grows in nutrient-poor soil. So instead of relying on roots, it evolved a different strategy. It eats insects. Its leaves are modified into traps, lined with trigger hairs. When a bug touches one hair, nothing happens, but touch two hairs within 20 seconds, and the trap snaps shut, in less than a second. It's one of the fastest movements in the plant kingdom, no muscles, no nerves, just pressure, water, and precision. Once the trap closes, the plant checks, is it food, or a false alarm? If the insect struggles it triggers more hairs, that tells the plant, this is real. Then it seals the trap tight, airtight, and begins to digest, it releases enzymes, breaks down the insect, absorbs the nutrients, and after 5 to 12 days, it reopens, empty, ready to hunt again. But here's the twist. The Venus flytrap doesn't waste energy. If the trap closes on a raindrop or a leaf, it reopens in hours. No digestion, no effort wasted. It's not just a trap, it's a decision maker. And it's not alone. Other carnivorous plants use sticky leaves, pitfall traps, or suction bladders. But the Venus flytrap? It's the only one that snaps shut. It's native to a small region in the Carolinas, USA. But it's famous worldwide, a symbol of nature's weirdest adaptations. Scientists study it to understand movement without muscles, decision-making without a brain, and evolution under pressure. Because this plant didn't choose to hunt, it had to. Its soil lacked nitrogen, so it adapted, it turned passive leaves into active traps. It's not just survival, it's strategy. So next time you think plants are boring, remember the Venus flytrap. It waits in silence, it senses, it strikes, no eyes, no brain, just pure trap the plant that hunts.